Hello everybody. In today's video we're going to be reviewing the Noah Wood Short Nose Short Tail Complete. Make sure you're subscribed for future content and let's get into it. Reviewing this product was actually a suggestion from one of my viewers, so if there's something that you would like to see me review on this channel, make sure you leave that in the comment section. First things first, I think the packaging is super clean. It came in this little box with a little sliding drawer here. We'll get into the board in just a second, but I was really impressed with just how much they included here. In the box, the first thing I noticed was this cool little Noah Wood screwdriver, which is a lot easier to use because of the grips here than the small little screwdrivers that a complete typically comes with. It did come with one of those as well for the lock nuts. Came with not one, but two sheets of grip tape. And when I tell you every extra supply that you can imagine, it came with extra lock nuts, it came with extra screws, washers, bushings, these little plastic things that I've never seen before. Maybe somebody in the comments can tell me what that is. And of course, deck, trucks, wheels, and these super cool little screws that pop right off the grip tape. This complete was only 33 bucks. I'm like flabbergasted. I think the packaging is fantastic. All the extras is such a sweet add-on. The deck itself looks awesome. I wouldn't say the trucks are anything overly fantastic, but they're sturdy and responsive. And you can see the Noah Wood writing on the wheels here. I was interested to see what the shorter nose and tail would do, but on a side-by-side -side with some of my other decks, it doesn't seem noticeably different. I'm going to give the deck a 10. I like the green top sheet, the graphics sweet, the glossy finish is nice, and it has some great pop to it. But let me know in the comment section what you would give this thing on just looks alone. The trucks, as I mentioned, don't jump off the page to me, but they're serviceable and they function nicely. So I'm going to say about a 7 out of 10. The wheels I'll also give about a 7. They don't have the greatest spin in the world, but they're certainly more detailed than most of the complete wheels you're going to find. The grip actually feels quite nice, and the extra sheet goes a long way in my opinion, so I'm going to give it an 8. All in all, I would confidently recommend this product. I was pretty thrilled with the purchase. If there's anything that you'd like to see me review, make sure you leave that in the comment section below. As always, like the video if you felt it helped, and stay subscribed for future content, and we'll see you in the next one.